Welcome back to another episode of Divine Divinity. In the previous episode, we fought the. we found a ninja. And. what else did we do? Talked to more farmers, got wrecked by snakes. And talked to these religious people that wanted me to open this locked gate, but I have no idea how to do it. Actually, I do. I have to find a dude in Rivertown or something. Come on. I'm holding it so you run. There we go. And. Yeah, let's just look around this area. Gotta zoom out. Not sure why I'm so zoomed in. There we go. Nericon's gate. Merchant Blake. Oh, there's the merchant all the way over there. So let's just go around. Talk to the merchant, he's the one that has the key for this place. That was random. Don't you go through that wall. I'm not getting any lifesteal, am I? Is this the same blade? Bloodsucker. I guess I can't get lifesteal from corpses since they're dead. Not, there we go, I am getting some. It's just that these guys hit hard. I gotta watch out. How, how are we on potions? Uh, one of each. Let's take that one. Yeah, these corpses hit hard. We gotta watch out for them. I'll avoid fighting them from now on for now. And let us do a little bit of jogging. Oh jeez. Okay. Ow! No. No. Why are they... This boar is in leagues with... Freaking, uh... Trolls. Oh no, you didn't. No, I really am not getting as much life still as I used to. That's weird. Not sure why. Nothing's wrong with it. Life drain too. Maybe it's because they're higher levels or something? I'm not sure. And this snake. This snake. I don't wanna fuck with snakes too much. I know how much trouble they are. How's the map? This guy's down here. Anything inside these barrels? Some gold. Not a. This one's the one that has three. Garbage. Ah, just the one with garbage. Hmm. This game is quite slower than what I had rem uh, well not remembered Th than I had thought. Just because of all the stuff you can do, I forgot how to sheave my weapon. Ah, oh, it's not T. Is it E? No. V. C. C. Okay. It me. Oh, what the hell? I'm not even gonna repeat what he's saying because it's weird. What are you doing, sir? I'm preparing myself for my performance, Dullard. What are you performing? I'm reciting poems. The beautiful poems of Alric Fasbois. I've never heard of him. Could you give me an example? Oh, I don't know. Perhaps if I gave you ten gold. Oh, well, okay. Alright. Let's give him gold. Right then, just give me a second. Excellence. And I say to you that the winds are spoken words, whispering whispers, roaring, shouting, a voice from the outer worlds. No matter what race, no matter what species, the winds speak to us. That was beautiful. Oh, who this? Bravo! Bravo! 
encore. A most excellent performance. And it is hard to listen to them. But they are there. The voices of the wind. They guide us through our lives. Still Down the ages. Nowhere. The echoing of the wind. Crying. Whispering. Screaming. Weeping. Breathing. Okay. So. What do I get? Talk to you again. I can't talk to him. Can I talk to you? No, can't talk to you. Well, I can talk to you though. It's a fine night, stranger. Um, you're not a mugger, are you? Hello, noble citizen. Is there any news that we dis decent folk should take interest in? The latest craze among we persons of good breeding is to wear lots of little green feathers in our hair. Do you see mine? It's supposed to indicate our devotion to nature. Or something like that. All I know is that it takes hours for my servants to tie them in each morning and remove them at night. How are we slaves to fashion? How we are slaves to fashion. Uh, farewell to you. And your available opinion. These people. Uh, na, 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 na. What's this guy doing? Merchant Blake over there. Alright, we gotta find Blake. Uh. Don't be dawdling, citizen. Move on now, move on. That attitude of guards is the same everywhere, I suppose. It really is. Okay. Oh. Is it this guy? Yep. Welcome to my humble shop of charity adventure. My name's Blake, and I sell rare articles at reasonable prices. Also, I will donate a third of anything you spent to the poor needy. So shop with good conscience at my expense. Sounds like a nice fella. Very commendable. But why are you donating money to the poor? Oh god. The paragraphs return. Listen, uh, listen, friend. I know what it's like growing up in a gutter. I had to fight for food in a place out of the rain from age of three years old. I saw my entire family dead of disease and starvation before I was ten. Wow. I was lucky. A kind blacksmith made me his apprentice when I was twelve. I made enough money to buy his buy this place his place. And now I make a reasonable turnover of gold. But I still see kids starving in the streets every day, so I try to make a difference, even if it leaves me short of money much of the time. Okay. Looking for rare items. Do you sell anything special? Let's see. Let's do this one first. Not far from here, I've met a philosopher and two of his followers. They need a certain... You're talking about auto? Better drop the subject, friend. I don't want them to... Uh, I don't want to have anything to do with this madman. Better worked for me before he was persuaded by Otto to follow him. Lazy people. Uh, Alright. Looking for rare items? Well, maybe I have something you'll be interested in. Did you ever hear the story of Narakan's Garden? Far to the west, close to the Cursed Abbey, lies the huge garden which was built by the mighty wizard Narakan. Go on. Back there in the Age of Deception, there was an evil despot who ruled Rivertown. Affirmation, Narakan. On one black morning, Narragan decided that Rivertown was to be the site of the most magnificent garden in Rivellin. Aye, and what happened? Running away. All the trouble of building a garden in town is that towns tend to have folks living where you want to build them. So to create the least fuss for his rich supporters, Narragan had the palace guard drive all the people of the poor section of town and set light to the houses in checks there. <coughs> Sorry about that. You can always tell, uh, you can always tell an evil rule because he picks on a poor folk. So this Nerikon burned down the people's houses to build a useless garden. Oh yes, thousands of slaves, mostly the this, this possessed poor folk, labeled, uh, labored day and night to create the most beautiful garden Riblin had ever seen. After the completion of this garden. American stole, uh, stored all his most precious treasures in a vault hidden deep, hidden beneath its rolling trees, flowers, and lawns. Clever, you see. 
he'd made the most pretty treasure vault in the world. Very poignant, but what's Narakan's uh, garden got to do with your rare items? Ah, <laughs> Believe it or not, I got a copy of the key to Narakan's garden. One of my ancestors was a slave in the small shrub squad and managed to steal the spare key. It's been, it, it's been handed down from generation to generation in my family, but none have dared risk using it. I'm no adventurer. Besides, there are dozens of kids out on the streets that'd starve if I let myself get killed. But lately I've been thinking that somebody else should use the key to get a fet. Uh, where can I find this garden? Let me show you on your map. There it is. West of the market area. I already know where it is, but just in case. Um... So how much do you want for it? Well, I swear that I would only sell the key to a person who enjoys a good reputation. I don't want a wicked person to get access to the treasure of Nerican's garden, you see? There's enough rich bastards in the world without adding their number, I'm afraid. Oh, not now. I'm afraid from what I've heard of you, I can't trust you. Wow. Just yet. Come back with a few more good deeds to your name and we'll see, alright? So, he's talking about... I can't pop it up now. Is it why? I, I can't do it because I'm in a conversation, so. Let's see what I hit. No, I'll do that later in a sec. And. Let's check it. You press I. Now that's invent inventory. T. Reputations 4. That's the neutral one. We gotta increase that. And he'll give us the key, apparently. So. Now that that's over with. I'll skip this. Alright, so I bought a few health potions and also restoration. <laughs> I have learned restoration. Cost me 5,000 gold. Let's see. Nope. Nope. Is it tea? Nope. What the hell is it? Uh, where's the skills? Oh, damn it. Ow. Oh. <laughs> I forgot. Uh, let's browse the skills here. That's not what I wanted to do, but. Uh, send your magical energy coursing through your veins to restore your health after battle. That is going to be really handy since we will need to constantly use potions. We can just use our mana and heal ourselves. So that's good. It's very good. Uh, sh how do I take this away? Take it away. And, okay kitty. I need a bed. Let's test out the skill right now. Where's my ring? Damn it. Did I sell? Okay. No, it's still here. Well, I sold one of the rings. I sold the, the diamond ring because I don't need it. Uh, restore. Oh, that is going to be really handy. Except it takes a decent amount of mana. And... Put that back. Alright. Heard any news lately, officer? No, 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 he hasn't heard anything. So, we'll need to increase our reputation before coming to him. These are the, the same fellas. This is a river town, or Ribbelon. Hmm. I'm still not sure what the heck's up with the, the farmers. I have to go back and check it out, because I didn't finish checking out what was wrong. What the hell? Oh, that's this is a thug. This is a, a really weak enemy. I approve of this. I actually haven't saved it, so let's do a really quick save. And Voila. That's pretty damn rude. 
What are it? These are like some post-apocalyptic enemies in a fantasy RPG. Interesting. Yeah. Oh, got wrecked. Ooh, that was interesting. New type of enemy. Right outside of town, too. It's fucking rude. Where is it? It's a cursed abbey. I mean, who's responsible for that harvest disaster? Somebody has poison there. I mean, do I have to talk to all of them again? Is that how I find out who's responsible for it? Not sure there's a way to investigate that. Thoroughly. Talk to you again. What's wrong with your harvest? Uh. Alright. So. We'll have to check the other farmers and see. See what's up. Is that a weapon? Quarter staff. Oh, it's a shitty weapon. No one cares about that. Have I checked this? These are the cattle. Oh my god, the skeletons are still here. <laughs> oh no. Why are they still here? <laughs> oh, what have I done? I didn't expect them to still be here. That's random. Welcome back, young and Sit you down and listen to that. Damn it. I'll take care. Buzz. Buzz, you, you're one sketchy dude. This door is locked tighter than a dwarf's ale purse. Uh, let's see how it'll. Uh, what it'll do now? What if I just check this? No. Nothing. Why, why the hell was this locked then? No, no, don't go around. Contains nothing. 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 I locked the. I locked picked this for no reason. How about this cow? Neutral. Neutral cow. There is... Mm. Oh, shit. You're one spooky cow. <gasps> Another teleporter. Move this damn straw. Wait, eh. it's so awkward to move this shit. Why is this teleporter hidden behind hay and straw? Teleporter activate. Can I activate. I need the scroll of the human race to activate this teleporter. How the hell do I get that one? Scroll of the human race. Spell scroll scroll. Is this tell me where they are? Farlands. Nah, this one doesn't tell me. Okay, I completely forgot where he told me where the other scrolls are. I know the elf one actually is by the... What the hell? It's... It's a sketchy looking hay pile. It's all shiny. Why is it daytime? Oh, I can sleep. <laughs> I can sleep on the hay. Oh, well, that's handy, I guess. There's something down here. Oh, I can't I go around? Come on. I have to go all the way over here. Yeah, if, uh, 
think I'm just gonna head to the barracks because I, at the moment, I have no idea how to. What the fuck? Okay, so let's switch to our special moves. It's a bit and what was that? Oh. Sir Ook adds minor resistance to fire bonus to an item that can be charmed. Oh, there it is. I guess what the. Oh, no, 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 no. These drum guys. They fuck me up. I'm not strong enough yet. Hmm. This is why we gotta do the quests first. The ones that, that are at hand. If only I could find at least a cow thief. Got some pumpkins. Oh! Oh, I could take the pumpkins. Nice. I'll have to drop something. I'm carrying too much. God damn it. Pumpkins are too heavy, I guess. Pumpkin weighed 200. Oh, shit. Yeah, that explains it. And why are you following me? Get out of here, mate. Alright, let's get that a little bit because of the alarm again. And... What do we have here? I was going to do something. Check my weights. So... I'm still not sure who the cow thief is. Or what the reason... What's poison in their crops? No idea how to figure out how to. Yeah, how to find out who did it. Basically. I have no idea what this place is, but it's friggin' huge. Who goes there? Let me just walk in. What the? This is a fancy place. Oh, it's a tavern. Wait. Is this where I'm supposed to be? No, it's not. Hello there. What's a nice fellow like you doing roughing around in a place like this? Hello, friend. Any tavern gossip about? We were just telling ghost stories. You hear the one about the haunted abbey just now? Fair, give me the shivers. All those dead monks doomed to wander in the place for all eternity. They must have done great wickedness to deserve such a fate. Okay, thanks for your time. See you later. Ah, welcome to the blue boarding, my uh, good friend. You shall find the finest wine for sale in my establishment. It is common knowledge, but where are my manners? My name is Splinter, and I am at your service. Splinter. Yes, that is my name. I own the Blue Boar, and I am your host and faithful servant. I welcome you... Uh, I would welcome something to clear the dust from my throat, Splinter. Okay, I really don't no need this. You see, we're selling the finest stuff. Oh, alright then. Hello, waitress. Hello, I'm rather busy. Please talk to the bartender. Mm mm. Ah, oh, someone else. Hello, inventor. I'm glad you found your way to me. I'm just. something rare magical items, powerful artifacts. A magic carpet. <laughs> A carpet. Do I look like a housewife to you? Why would I need a carpet? I said magic carpet. If you lay it on the floor and you say the magic word right on the washing instruction label there, it'll fly. It'll carry you wherever you want. Uh, how much do you want for it? That cheap to you, governor. Only 500 gold pieces. Damn, I don't have enough money to buy it. I'm not buying that crap. <laughs> it's obviously a ripoff. I just wanted to see what what a uh, conversation would lead to. 
You're a mighty warrior by the looks of you. A spare coin for the weak in the suit. It's a hard world out there. Can you help me by sharing any gossip you've heard? A lot of young girls have been missing in Verdistus over the last few months. Folks around here believe a group of cultists calling themselves the Flagged Sin or Sing are stealing the girls and forcing them to commit diabolical acts. I hardly dare go out these nights, lest they grab me. Thank you for your time, sister. What's in here? This is a very nice looking place. Let's check down what's down into the random hatch. Everything seems to be in order. Any secret set dungeons or, or something? Anything at all? Oh, wrong move. Uh, damn it. Inventory. No. No skills. That's what I want it. Lockpick failed. Shit. Not good enough. This place seems clear. No reason to be down here. Oh, damn it. So I thought this place would have some clue to what's going up in the farms, but it seems like a normal place to me. There's a key. There's the chests. And nah, I don't need this. Barely does enough damage. Getting at least to the outside. That's a doge. Why is there no one at the counter? This is a shitty place. I guess this is also an inn and not just a Oh ow, 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 ow. Oh. I didn't mean to kill the dog. Fuck. Good morrow to- <laughs> Why did it attack me? I don't even. Good morrow to you. Uh, hello, nice to meet you. How are you? Not too well, but regarding the, the conditions, but I wish I could leave from here as soon as possible. You cannot leave? I have the impression that you're looking for someone or something. Maybe I can help. Yes, I'm looking for somebody, that's true. You see, my family and I lived in a cottage in a village over yonder. The orcs burnt, the bill, uh, burnt and pillaged everything. We had to run for our lives with only what we could carry to our names. That's too bad. Where's your family now? They're already on their way to the farmlands. I'm planning to follow them as soon as possible. A good plan. Uh, Good plan, but be careful on these roads. There are many rogues and bandits abroad. I know, but we're poor people. Why should they slay us if they see we have no money to steal? But before I can go, I have to tell my uncle that we're leaving. And where he can come and find us. Where does your uncle live? He lives in Verdistus. If I could find somebody who could deliver a letter to him. Maybe you were going to Verdistus in the near future. Would you take him our letter? Aye, of course. I'll do you the favor. We must help each other in these hard times. What is the name of your uncle and where can I find him? Thank you. That's... <laughs> that's so very kind of you. The name of our uncle is Af Afrasam. Metriosymphus. You should find him in Verdistus easily enough. He is the innkeeper of the Ducal Inn. I'll leave very soon before fresh calamities befall me. Thank you again, stranger. Uh, good luck with you all. Oh, Alright. So we got another quest. And... We're just we're just getting more quests. I'm not sure why that dog attacked me. I think it's because I might have taken the key. Out of curiosity, but I didn't take the staff. What the heck is this? But yeah, that's it for this episode, everyone. I know not much happened. Just like the past two episodes, well, besides the attack of the doge. And yeah, hopefully next episode we'll figure out what to do with the farms. And if not, I'll just move on to the barracks. But before I go to the barracks, I really want to 
I'm gonna figure out what's up with the farms because that would be some good XP and we still can't beat those orc drummers and those mess us up real bad but yeah thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one